guys. So, today is the day that I go to my eye appointment. Um, and it's actually exciting because I get to figure out when my surgery is going to be. In the sky today, it's so nice and pretty. Look. Work. I got one unhealthy thing and one healthy thing. On the way to the um, eye doctor now, so yay! Got the eye doctor, look at all this equipment. A lot of letters. Yeah, all those letters down there. Not with your right eye, you got all those. It's your left eye. Yeah, my left eye. I was sitting here. I turned a T into a Y, a Y into a T. Oh my surgery. Date is set, yay! We are doing it on February 6th. Woohoo! That's in two weeks, correct? Three weeks. Three weeks. It's going to be on a Friday. Um, apparently. Days. Yeah, it's going to be 16 days, is what my dad just said. But I'm excited because I'm ready to get over with. <laughs> but anyway, um, what I was going to say. You're not gonna dance. Dance. No. There it is. This is a restaurant called Pugin's Porch, and if you really want a haunted place, go up to the bathroom upstairs and don't see a lady in a white dress sitting up there. We used to go in the back back there to have a model, everything here. Yay, how pretty that is. Nah, that's cool. That's the road, that's the, goes to James Island. That's the bridge we normally go on. It's the draw bridge. We normally go on that one. It's a new one apparently. Go for a dreaming right there. It looks like a fort, but it's not. Four gals right there. It's a good shot. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at that. You got a bridge in the back. I know. I right saw. Now. Right. Well. Oh, you had it. Right there. So I hope y'all enjoyed that little montage video of downtown Charleston. That's um, our downtown. So if you enjoyed it, just tell me. Um, that was pretty much like the second montage I've done. The first one was a bike ride, um, and it, I, I could have done a lot better. But I think this one you're gonna really enjoy. There, there's actually a beautiful view where we're at now. 
please turn around here. But, um, I don't really want to do another montage. But, uh, if you've ever heard of Drayton Hall Plantation, that's the direction we're going. Here it is. Bam. Anyway, um, so, if you've ever heard of Milton Plantation, I took a field trip there one year. I think it was in fourth grade. Yeah. No, fifth grade. It was either fourth grade or fifth grade. I'm seventh now, but it was one of those. But anyway, um, we took a field trip to Milton Plantation, and it was really cool because if you've ever heard of James and Milton, he signed the Declaration of Independence, and his body there was this big um, stone building, and if you could open the door, there's a key. Actually, I think they said it's hidden on the plantation somewhere, buried um, with him. And you can go in if you ever find the key and see his dead body. But it's really cool. And there's Magnolia Gardens here, too. There's too many gardens around here. This is Magnolia Plantation. 1676. 1676. Yeah. It's pretty crazy. But uh, we're kind of in the sticks right now. As you can see. Yeah. So, we're in the sticks. <laughs> this car here is killing me. Hey, here's Teeter, and I got something healthy. It's covered in feta cheese, but that's my favorite. And it's like different salads like chicken, pasta, um, crab salad, shrimp salad, all that stuff. We went to the grocery store and, and got some stuff for tomorrow. Some chips, whole wheat bread, this is for my lunch, and then Nature Valley and Greek yogurt, and then some pudding just to slack off a little bit, and protein bars. So then tonight I'm making that that sun dried tomato. We forgot the pasta. Oh, go get the pasta. So, um, we forgot to get the, um, sun dried tomato pesto. That's why I ran back and couldn't, like, vlog. But anyway, what I'm making tonight is that recipe that I found a few days ago. And what it is, is sun dried tomato chicken breast. And I'm gonna have on the side some roasted peppers. And, um, I'm gonna pan sear the chicken. And then do what I need to do with that. And then serve it. So, yay. I'm finally getting back to my um, kind of cooking. I don't know how to explain it. Like, um, my cooking kick. My cooking kick. And, um, if y'all enjoy what I cook, um, I might cook a lot more often now. And if you like what I'm cooking in vlogs, then y'all need to um, comment down below. And if you want a cooking channel, I would not mind um, making one. Or maybe a cooking um, folder playlist in my um, regular channel. Because, um, you know, that's going to be another email I have to sub and da 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 So I might just create a playlist for my cooking. And you don't have to watch it. You can just go back to the regular vlogs and pranks and stuff. Some people haven't even watched one prank. They just watch my vlogs. Some people watch my prank but don't watch my vlogs. Some people, if I do cooking, they might just watch cooking and not watch anything else. And I'm perfectly fine with that. Um, it's your preference. I made all of them so everybody can enjoy. Um, and so, yeah. And we're on the way home. And then we'll get back to the cooking. Oh, wrap it up. Wow, Dad. Wrap it up. So, I finished the um, pesto and added some oregano and basil and, um, what you want to call it, and garlic to that. And then I have squash and green peppers to go inside, and they're covered in a little bit of olive oil. And some salt and pepper and these are going on the top of the chicken when it's done and the chicken's actually in the oven right now cooking so yeah 
So that's how I throw it down in the kitchen. Uh, I do this very rarely, but I think I'm going to start doing it more because now we're on a diet. And so it's better to do that more than go out to eat, then you're tempted to get something that's unhealthy. And look at all of our pantry, it's all open and stuff. Oopsie. I guess my dad's putting all of our groceries away. But, um, yeah. so, that's how I throw it down in the kitchen, guys. Right there, bam. No product. So that's the um, chicken with um, sun-dried tomatoes, and then those are my veggies that I roasted in the oven. Green peppers and some squash, and some baby tomatoes on top. If you want the recipe, um, I can put a picture of it below, and we'll get back to the regular vlogs. Guys, I'm going to bed, so um, hope you enjoyed the vlog today. Uh, I heard a little bit about my eye surgery a little bit more. And um, so yeah. Peace.